Welcome back to Medina County, Texas GMRS. Hadn't seen y'all in a while, been a little busy. We got some updates going on with the Vertex right here. You can see my, my desk hasn't changed all that much. It's all cluttered, but I'm going to explain why. So let me get turned around here and we'll show y'all what's going on out in Medina County, Texas. Alright, so I've never pointed you over this way in the shack, but this half is where I do leather work, and then this half is all the GMRS stuff, right? So, I've got to show you over here today because we are upgrading the tower for the Dunley repeater. And just want to show you some of the things going on, then we'll go outside and look, but... Um, had a you know over the course of the last several months we've we've met a lot of, of cool people um, here in the local area and um, one of the one of the guys that is out here I'll show y'all that in a minute one of the guys that is out here he does radio work and and, and there's another guy too I, I don't want to mention their names because I didn't get their permission but they know who they are and I uh, greatly appreciate them but um, one of the fellas, he, he offered to, to, he said, hey, I got some uh, 7 8 inch Heliacs uh, that I'll give you. And I said, well, I feel bad just taking it. And he said, well, give me 50 bucks. And, and I didn't know what I was getting into. <clears throat> just for a size, th this is my finger. It is, it is larger around than my finger. It's copper. Your center conductor, your, your sheath there is, is copper. This stuff is wicked. He sold me this for $50.00 said he'd had it out in his barn for a while but it is 73 feet so i'll explain to you why we're going to need 73 feet look at these connectors for this thing it is i mean they're they're humongous but uh very easy to put on as long as you get this stripped down right um we've once again i'm kind of going in a backwards order but here's the mounting hardware for the antenna i'm fixing to show you we got the uh, com scope. I couldn't remember the name. We got the com scope four element antenna uh, for GMRS. We got that in the mail. That was not a cheap purchase there, but everybody boasts about about it. Um, so we're going to be feeding the com scope with this, and once again, it's. We're going to end up having to move the Vertex up on this shelf where I'm keeping some of my leather stuff. Um, but you'll see in just a minute why we're going to have to move it up there. Um, so this is this is part of the stuff that's been going on. Um, you can see over here we got nuts and bolts for the tower. Um, so let, let's go outside and take a look at the tower. And, and you can see what we're what we're upgrading to. And yet, yeah, I haven't even touched those uh, those Redivis because I've just been too busy with the th this other stuff. But let's go outside and take a look at the tower and what we got going on out there. All right, so this is the hole. I did not dig it. I'll flash some pictures up there. Best $100 I ever spent. This is two foot by two foot and a little over three foot deep. And any of y'all that live in South Texas know that it's nothing but but rock out here in Medina County it's Flint Rock so this is the position or the the place where the tower is going to be we'll be removing some of these antennas but the tower is going to go right here and the repeater will sit right inside on the other side of that wall so um, so that's why the repeater will need to be moved let's come over here and take a look so another fella who lives local he donated a few uh three sections of tower plus the top cap there um all of these are are used i bought i think it was four sections and one top cap uh repurposed right but it, it had been in an accident and um uh, I paid $400 for that, which I think is a pretty good deal, even though there are a few bent sections, and you might be able to even see 
a bin and a few, but we, we're not going to use those. If anybody knows the, the best way to straighten any of them out, let me know. Um, and then, like I said, the other guy donated three pieces uh, to me today. So we're trying to get this about 65 feet in the air. Um, we got this base plate, the tilting base plate mounted. I think I put some pictures on there for you all the other day i put a lot of pictures on facebook so any of you who uh who aren't on facebook or hadn't hadn't looked me up on facebook it's medina county texas gmrs so this this is the project for my vacation this week um so there you go that's why you haven't seen much of me while i'm on vacation we had somebody give us some old DirecTV dishes and with these you can make directional GMRS antenna well you can make any any type of antenna but we're going to try to uh, get some directional GMRS antennas and why that's important is if you live in a neighborhood with restrictions um, they all allow you to put up a dish so you could actually put a directional antenna up there and and be kind of covert about it. So we're going to try to make a few of those. I'll do a video on that. But um, but yeah. So this is the uh, this is the reason you hadn't seen much of me. We're working tirelessly to uh, to try to get this uh, this thing about sixty five feet up there, which will be taller than. Than that i think the tip of that antenna you're looking at about oh probably 50 so we should be 10 15 feet higher than that is the hope let's go back inside and close this out all right so just wanted to show you all that i hope you enjoyed taking a look um once again sorry i haven't done the reviews on those redivus radios right there and a few other things uh I do have enough photos for another Show Us Your Shack episode, so that'll be coming. Hopefully, I'll get time this week to uh, to do that. Um, if any of you have experience with that Heliax, feel free to comment and uh, let me know your experience with it. The, the line loss on it is, I mean, next to nothing. We're going to have it... God, I keep... I'm using my phone, and I keep putting my hand in the way. Uh, we're going to have it come from that corner of the shack, um, and then we're going to pop a hole through, and then we're we're just going to go straight from that to, we'll move the duplexer also, but we'll put it up there and just go straight from that Heliax to the uh, to the duplexer uh, to, to try to mitigate any extra line loss that... Uh, that we might have um as y'all know that th this vertex is only kicking out i think after the duplexer right at right at 30 watts um so we want to save any of that we can since we have a a lot longer run going uh going up hold on i showed y'all my the cup my wife got me right my medina county texas gmrs cup i love it um so if any of you have experience with uh those Ron Towers, or I think it's American, they're, they're all kind of universal. Feel free to leave comments. I, I am open to everybody's feedback. Um, if it's bent and you think it's shit and shouldn't be used at all, uh, tell me. I, you know, um, Once again, we're doing this on a budget and I'm doing it for the... Eh, I forgot I had the scanner on, sorry. Um... Doing it on a budget. Uh, there are several straight pieces out there, but give me your thoughts on the uh, on the ones with the slight bend to them. Um, like I said, if they got to go to the scrapyard, they got to go to the scrapyard, right? All right. I appreciate each and every one of you. I hope y'all have been well. Hope you uh, are having fun with uh, all the GMRS stuff going around in your local area. Uh, we do have some big news. Our application was accepted and approved. There's still some legwork we have to do to get this thing going that we that we started a, a month or so ago, well, about two months ago. And as soon as it is official, uh, then then I can I can spill the beans. So y'all have a great day. We're up to 920 subscribers, 1,000. We get to do another giveaway. 
I do recommend you joining Facebook. Uh, I think I'm going to do the final giveaway on Facebook because it's a hell of a lot easier to find the winner. I still have these SDRs sitting up here, and I have reached out. Look, I still have four SDRs, and I am not doing anything with them until I find the official winners from the uh, the last drawing. Um, so find me on Facebook. It's the Facebook group, Medina County, Texas, GMRS, just like the channel here. And uh, I, I post a lot more on there. So y'all have a good one. Nice seeing y'all. Take it easy.